Hi Virgo, welcome to your weekly love reading and extended on my Patreon. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I appreciate your love and support. Please bear in mind that this is not a personal reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Time and energy is fluid, so this reading could resonate with you in the past, currently, or in the future. All right, Virgo, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me important, accurate love messages for Virgo for this week. You guys know I love this card. This is you. I love it. Okay, please show me more, Spirit. Nice. Okay. The Lovers Virgo. Okay, please don't forget that roles can be reversed in this reading. Could either be you or the other person you are thinking about or dealing with. Um, the roles will not be specific, okay? Again, this is a general reading. If this was a personal reading, then uh, each person will be identified accordingly. But since this is a general reading, just take what resonates with you, okay, Virgo? Thank you so much. And we've got the Nine of Pentacles here, Virgo. This is your energy. I love it. It means that you are um, taking care of yourself. You are looking absolutely uh, gorgeous. This is a very gorgeous card. This is just, you're on your way to the Empress status here, okay, Virgo? So, um, doesn't matter male or female, it is not gender specific, okay? So, Nine of Pentacles, somebody could be watching you doing so well um, despite the separation because we've got the Ten of Cups in reverse here. So, you're yeah, taking care of stuff, you're taking care of yourself, taking care of business, looking absolutely gorgeous. And we've also got the Four of Swords here. This is an indication of perhaps somebody watching you doing really, really well, even more attractive more attractive than ever okay and now they are thinking now they are planning or contemplating on possibly moving towards karma water with you reaching out you know moving closer to you it could also mean that but again virgo roles can be switched here and we've got the empress so virgo this is again this is you the empress to me okay we can read it as you know taurus libra but to me the empress is also an earth energy so it could be a, even a virgo capricorn and a taurus but this is a lot of readers do read the empress actually more of a strong virgo okay so this is you so what I'm seeing here is you are you're looking really good despite the separation. You're keeping yourself together. And now somebody is scratching their head. Now somebody is thinking again, should I reach out to Virgo? And should I move towards Kama Water with them as in making peace with you or moving towards you physically? Uh, getting closer to you because you know now they see you they possibly want to make you their empress or their emperor so because the nine of pentacles is usually single right a single person but um it may not always mean a single person actually um nine of pentacles could just mean somebody actually very very uh, uh independent very self-sufficient very very capable and abundant as well as um, uh, prosperous right this is nine of pentacles is only one step below the empress is on on her way to becoming an empress so it looks like somebody here wants to make you theirs because the empress is a mother material wife material or husband material uh, father material somebody very abundant but the empress is not single right so it looks like someone wants to unsingle you and make you theirs perhaps this is somebody from your past because ten of cups is in reverse so you are going through you you have gone through separation with this person right but this could just also be your energy that you have thought things through and that you could have been thinking a lot and planning about your future because the empress is the highest level and 
you know, uh, among the queens and the rest. So it looks like you could also be planning your future with somebody, right? But two of pentacles in reverse here, Virgo, this indicates somebody making a choice. I feel like one t uh, at one point in time, you could have been dealing with somebody who may not be 100% sure or, you know, there's something, something off here. Perhaps someone was um, taking you for granted with the emperor in reverse here. Could I put you in a third party situation? Situation because we've got the Queen of Wands in reverse, so I do read her as the other woman or the other man. Again, it is not gender specific. So from juggling previously and you know not seeing your worth, now they start to see your worth with the Two of Pentacles in reverse. So and now and this is again your energy. So Virgo, this spread is actually looking really gorgeous because all the signs, all the cards that. Um, represent your energy they are all in an upright position except for i mean for your person actually you could be dealing with um an aries here okay it's in reverse so we all know that the emperor is an aries sign so but you could also be dealing with just any uh, fire signs okay aries sagittarius leo and i also see very strong libra gemini aquarius and your sign which is virgo capricorn taurus and strong gemini again so got the lovers right here so virgo somebody is stressing out right nine of nine of swords in reverse because they want you back but the three of cups here in uh three of cups here in reverse definitely indicates that perhaps someone is stressing out they can't forget about you and they know it looks like you are at such a high level that they can't even they can't even get you to reconcile or that you may not or, or that you may not want to reconcile with this person okay perhaps you were being put in a third party situation or maybe that you wouldn't let them back in that easily okay so eight of pentacles is right here so it looks like you could be focusing on yourself focusing on work but this could also indicate that perhaps somebody from your past wants to focus on working on this connection or focusing on thinking and planning and strategizing how do i go about getting my virgo back again roles can be switched all right five of swords is right here so this could be an indication of someone either wanting to throw in the towel or wanting to fight at all costs. Um, but this is also an energy that can be a little bit deceptive, having some agenda as well, may not be 100% honest. So the Amber in reverse here, again, it could indicate somebody who has abused their power over you. Perhaps at one point in time, they thought that you, you, you loved them a lot and that as if you were never gonna leave but you left okay so it could mean that and queen of wands is in reverse though so hmm, both are in reverse so i'm sensing virgo your person and the third party didn't have a very happy ending um, between the two of them it looks like both of them um both of them may not uh, i don't think they are together okay but we're gonna clarify that actually virgo in the extended for your weekly we're gonna clarify what's going on between your person and this this third party okay although i do see perhaps they don't have a very happy ending themselves either okay so um three of cups is in reverse could also indicate that the third party may no long may no longer be in a picture but we've also got the seven of cups here so this could be a confusion possibly someone um, weighing out their options whether how how they should so i do see somebody here weighing their options whether you know they should come back whether they should reconcile or that or how to find ways to reconcile with you it could mean that so lovers is right here another indication of third party situation but the lovers could also indicate for me virgo when the moment i saw it intuitively i felt like they miss you okay i felt like they miss you they miss being intimate with you and um they've been going through they've been thinking a lot with the eight of swords here uh, it, this is guilt and shame to me as well um perhaps guilty and shameful for whatever they did to you in the past here okay but they do want to heal this connection with the nine uh nine of swords in reverse here 
Nine of Swords in reverse. Sometimes I get sorry. Sometimes I get the numbers wrong. I'm not good with numbers, but Nine of Swords in reverse. It could indicate someone is too tired of stressing out, too tired of overthinking, and wanting to actually also figure out ways to solve this situation or to get out of this feeling of anxiety and stress and even depression. So I do see Virgo, um, your person could be contemplating and coming back, reconciling. And also what I'm seeing is perhaps them and the third party did not work out either. Okay. Um, and they are planning something. It looks like they're planning something, planning to come back, but they just don't know how they're still confused. Uh, and they're still confused or they, or they could still be weighing options. Um, but we're going to be going to find out in the extended what's going on. First thing, what's going on between your person and the third party. Um, for me, my suspicion is that they are over, but we'll see. And also, uh, we'll find out how does your person currently feel about you. This is somebody in separation. Yeah, I definitely see that. Perhaps you have somebody new coming in as well. I'm sensing that also, but Virgo, we're going to find out how does your current person, past person, sorry, past person currently feel about you? What are their true intentions? And also, what is the most likely outcome between the two of you within this week? Don't take any of the time frame too seriously because, again, time is fluid. We believe in divine timing. And Virgo, and we'll find out if there's a new prospect for you in love as well. I do sense there could be somebody new. Okay, because the Empress, I mean, if somebody is looking that abundant and prosperous, it's, uh, you're meant to attract new, new love as well. All right, Virgo, so we're going to find out about that. Any new, new prospects when it comes to a new love as well and some advice for you. Um, if you're interested in the extended Virgo, the link is in the description box below. You can just click on it. It will bring you to my Patreon account. For the weekly extended reading, it's only $10.00 but you only get the weekly reading, weekly extended reading, okay? Not the all of the entire extended reading for the, um, for the, ex uh, for the entire week. So just didn't want to confuse you guys. But in any case, Virgo, if I don't see you at the extended, please hit like, share, and subscribe. And I hope to see you back here on my YouTube channel. If not at the extended, take care, Virgo. Bye.